Hello everyone, Cinema Plus here. Today we are going to talk about 5 popular movies on Netflix to watch right now. Starting off our list is number 5, Resort of Love. A New York based singer, Erica Wilson, grateful dressed for the launch event of her first song in the popular Sing Crew new album. However, at the event, annoyed by online leaks, she smashed her new album and declares her retirement. Erica Dreams and her songboat got broken into pieces. Resort of Love is a Netflix movie that premiered on 29 July 2001, starring Christina Milian. Jay Farrow, A Sequin Walls, is a romantic comedy movie that revolves around the love story of Erica, Johnson, and Khaled. Depressed from her career meltdowns, she takes a gig to Exotic Island where she met her ex boyfriend, Johnson. So, are you here on vacation? My brother's wedding is here. And there is the happy couple now. Erica? Things became more complicated when Johnson's brother, Khalid, made an appearance at the resort and started to show interest in Erica. The storyline is just as any other rom-com movie. With some endowing performance, a lot of romance and few love, it's a kind of format that won't surprise you much, missing all kinds of spontaneity, but it's filled with a lot of emotions and a happy ending that we often want to experience in our life. Johnson had finally decided to confess his love for Erica, and he comes to her room but he crashed seeing his brother, assuming the worst, he storms off. Erica follows Johnson and explains their problem, finally realizing that they are not ready for the marriage. Unfortunately, Beverly sees them together on the beach and after learning the truth from Johnson's mother, she runs off away from the venue. Number 4. Love and Monsters In order to keep an asteroid named Agatha 616 from having humanity die like the dinosaur, multiple nations send missiles at it and do end up destroying it. However, the chemicals from the massive amount of rocket rained down on Earth and led to everything from snails, ants, and frogs mutating and sometimes becoming multi-storied entitled. Though, leading to 95% of the population being wiped out in 7 years and what remains going either underground or into caves. But Joel, I've been scanning for Amy the entire time. And now, I finally found her. Joel! Hey! Joel! Amy! Is that you? Oh my god! Hey! After searching for his girlfriend for years, he finally learns what community she is in, and despite the danger, he makes a 7 day, 8 miles mile journey to be reunited. Though, considering Jewel has no little to no training and has been shielded from the outside world for the last 7 years, will he get to reunite with his girlfriend in life or will he have to wait until she dies as well? Coming on at number 3, Blood Red Sky. In Netflix supernatural trailer, Blood Red Sky, a crew of missionaries hijack the wrong plane and find themselves up against a vampire mother who will do anything to protect her son. The movie's ending brings their stories full circle to the prologue in which the plane has landed at a rev airbase in Scotland and the surrounding military have no idea of the night bear that awaits them inside. Blood Red Sky follows Niger. Imaginations. A single mother afflicted with vampirism who has been starving of her full transformation for years thanks to a careful regime of minimal blood drinking and medicine to keep her condition under control. When a doctor in the United States promises her the hope of a cure, Nadia takes overnight transatlantic flight with her son in the hope of being cured permanently. Unfortunately, the plane has been targeted by hijackers for hire who won't let the surprise appearance of a vampire stop them. At number 2 on our list, Sweet Girl. Sweet Girl is a family thriller, film stream on Netflix, is Ted Johnson Mormon and Isabel Messi in the lead role. Sweet Girl begins with a scene that portrays a middle-aged man, Ray Cooper, running away from a police squad. The law enforces Cooper Ray on a stadium top and to evade arrest, Ray jumps into the river. The timeline flows back in time and depicts the past event. Ray is a family man with a beautiful wife, Amanda and a teenage daughter, Rachel. His world gets turned upside down when a mother is diagnosed with cancer. To save his wife, Ray leverages everything, but the only available cure for her type of cancer is Ephemer. Ray and Rachel support Amanda through her treatment that brings the family closer to each other. In the meantime, Dr. Wu informs about an upcoming treatment, Pharaoh, that will bring new hope for Amanda. However, the drug. My wife was supposed to start a new medication. The company that makes the drug pulled it off the market. Paying competitors to shell generic brands of drugs? That is immoral. 
is pulled off from the market has its competitive brand, BioPrime, that makers of FM. The makers of Afemab bribe the manufacturer to avoid cost competition. Ray Cooper, as he goes on the run after his quest to bring down a big pharmacy conspiracy, takes a dark turn. He kills BioPrime, CEO, Kelly, and has to flee to Canada with his daughter, Rachel. However, as they are hunted by a shady villain looking to tie up loose ends, it becomes clear Rachel's actually the killer after her dad died trying to expose BioPrime deals. This led to a gripping climax where Rachel finally comforted the figure behind everything and proved that capitalism does not always work. Before we get to number 1 on our list, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. Finally, coming at number 1 on our list, Beckett. American tourist Beckett and his girlfriend April went for a vacation in Greece, but due to a political rally for the Greek political leader, Caris and Aten, they relocated their vacation spot. They decided to move to a place near Luania for a peaceful ambience. However, Bucket falls asleep on their overnight car trip and the car slips off the road and hits a house. Things go terrible when they get into a catastrophic car accident that kills April and leaves Bucket injured. After their car trumbles off the side of the windy road, it smashes through the side of a cottage where Bucket sees a young boy accompanied by a woman. The boy turns out to be a nephew of a controversial politician who had been kidnapped as an act of a protest. Because he has now laid eyes on the boy, Bucket suddenly becomes the subject of an epic, ruthless manhunt. The reminder of the movie follows him struggle to reach the American embassy in Greece in order to obtain safety and clear his name. Whilst also attempting to My friend, come out! It's a misunderstanding! No, so we'll take my place. I need help. I'm a US citizen. To invade being murdered by the dozen of people who have a gun pointed at him at every turn and understand why he, a male tourism from Ohio, has suddenly become Greece's most wanted man. After almost two hours, during the ending of the movie, Bucket managed to clear himself from the crime. If I do that, I'll be dead in 30 minutes. He ends up murdering a couple of bad guys who were out to get him and he's finally saved in the company of Liana. And be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos and drop a comment below if you enjoy it. Welcome.